this is Rashid today I'll show you a real implementation for advanced progress bar inside the marine.forms okay so first thing we'll do is creating new uh, visual studio app click here file new project once it open select course platform app here let's write here like dot progress bar example click ok it, it will ask you that uh, you should select blank app portable class library then click ok it will takes it will take some times to uh, create your project so here we have uh, four projects first one it's a portable uh, project which contains all our logic second one android version ios and the fourth one is universal window okay so let's back to our blog so our first task to create uh, our first step create a class called task item okay so let's come here class item let's add new class Let's copy here this one here. This class uh, task item uh, consists of uh, three attributes. First thing, task, task name, and weight. Task uh, it contains uh, the pointer for the task which we want to uh, do it or our code to execute task name to display it in the loading uh, bar okay and wait uh, which is uh, detect how much uh, uh, how how much how wait for this task okay uh, second thing uh, create custom progress bar content view so let's back here content view add new item form content view content view yes form content view xaml uh, yes this one sorry Here uh, we should copy this. This our uh, C sharp file. C sharp file. Let's come here. Click this. Here is uh, our implementation. Let's see now go to XAML. In XAML, we should copy all of this. Yes. Let's remove this section. Replace it here. And control B E. Let's 
so let's now create uh, uh, or add our uh, custom progress bar to our page so we already have uh, this page this one copy here main page Okay. And let's add our be uh, our custom view. Okay. So let's click this one. Okay, great. So let's now go to uh, implement the uh, C sharp file. I have changed the function name, here, this one. And let's back here to implement uh, this function so let's back here click this control V and here we'll create a 10,000 of uh, tasks okay and uh, this for uh, demo purpose to show you uh, how it works okay uh, and the name will task hash uh, number of this task okay so let's build now to see everything is working or not during this I will open uh, my Mac Apple so we can see it uh, in iOS okay uh, let's come here for Windows also let's rebuild rebuild is successful let's make this as uh, this set as a startup project okay let's uh, deploy deploy it succeeded uh, so we can now run here in the for window it opens it now So let's click here to test the progress bar here. As we see, it is task number and here is the compilation percentage. Okay. Uh, so let's click this. Let's close this. And let's connect to Mac to see it in Mac. Okay, here is our one. I already opened my Mac. Let's connect. Here it is still, it's already connected. Great. Let's click this one as our startup project. 
like this. And now here we can select iPhone simulator. And from here, okay, it's okay. iPad Air. It will open. Yes, it is loading now. It is already uh, open. So let's click here. The same behavior on iOS. And also the same behavior for Android. Thank you for watching. For more uh, videos and articles, please visit itlick.com.